Introduction of Elephant Polo. Welcome to another episode of Sports Encyclopedia series, where you can learn about every single game that's ever existed on planet Earth. Today in our Sports Encyclopedia series, we talk about Elephant Polo, so let's begin. Elephant Polo is a modified version of regular polo played on the backs of elephants. The game involves players struggling to get the ball into the goal while riding elephants. The basic objective of the game is to score more points than the opponent. How to play Elephant Polo? Elephant polo is played between two teams of eight players on a polo pitch. That's around three quarters of the length of a typical polo pitch. The game is played with a standard polo ball and a six to 10 foot cane stick with a polo mallet at the end. There are two regular polo goals placed on both ends of the field in a line dividing the court into two. The goal posts have a width of eight yards and are open at the top. Every team has four elephants and each elephant has two players on it. One player rides the elephant while the other player sits behind him directing the rider. The game begins with an umpire throwing the ball in between the two teams. Once the ball comes into play, both teams start struggling for possession of the ball to drive it into the opponent's goal. Players are allowed to pass the ball among each other using their mallets only. A goal is scored when the ball is shot through the goal post and every time a goal is scored, both teams change their halves. The game is played for four shakas or plays each one lasting seven minutes of actual gameplay. There are a total of three umpires that oversee the play. How to win in elephant polo? The team that manages to score the most goals in the given duration of time is declared as the winner. If a match is tied, another shaka is played in which the goalposts are widened and the first to score wins. If you like the video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.